Okay, this is April 15th, 2011. We got our fluidized bed combustor running. It's a uh, air fan with a variable speed control pumping air into the bottom of this chamber. We're using standard wood pellets as the fuel. We just dumped in a handful of wood pellets. It's burning quite nicely now. We're gonna see after a while when the wood pellets burn down, we get coals down there. You'll see the fluidizing action quite well. The air going down in there is starting to fluidize the coals. You'll see it start to move around. So give it a few moments and we'll just keep watching the fire. There we go. You start to see the fluidizing action there. There. You can see it turning around really nicely. So those are solid pellets, solid coals acting like a fluid. So fluidization works to uh, really get good mixing if you got a solid media like this. Now my hope is that the ash that settles down there becomes part of that mixing fluid and helps stabilize and equalize the temperature all throughout the combustion area. Yeah, we really need to turn our air down just a bit. One thing we could do, uh, gentlemen, we could put a valve in here and restrict the airflow. That is a little bit too much air. I'd like to be able to turn it down. Yeah, that's the minimum. So. Oh yeah, yeah look at that, look how quickly it's burning down. So now basically we've burned off all the lighter uh, volatiles. We're just down to burning carbon now. Look at that. Very, very hot. All right, I need an oven. Basically burning it down to nothing. <laughs> what we found in the past with the fluidized bed experiments is that just throwing a, like, throw some pellets in right now. We're almost down to the last coals. I want to see if it can ignite from what we have here. It might have been too much. We'll see, give it a moment. We found it was really resilient. It was really, yeah, I see some sparks. It's gonna take off. You can see the smoke here. Yeah, it's gonna relight. It's amazing how little was necessary to get it to relight. Cool. So our next phase uh, in the automation, uh, we want to get some uh, pressure measurement on this, on the airflow for the fluidization. We also want to get an auger set up that will meter in the fuel pellets so that we're not just throwing in clumps at a time. That way we can get a nice even burn. Excellent. I call this a success. <laughs>